The rate of drunk driving fatalities has dropped in the past three decades, but the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration says about a quarter of drunk driving cases and crashes involve underage drinking. Our Connor McHugh has details on a Colorado company that believes it has a solution. In 2022, 745 people died on Colorado roads, and almost 40% of incidents involved impaired driving. It's an issue local company SoberSafe is trying to get ahead of, first with this alcohol detection device, and now something new. We decided to be a game changer and be in front of the problem. CEO Dave Gandini is showing off the company's new alcohol detection band, which they'll start selling this August. Its sensor reads for ethanol, detecting whether alcohol is present or not. Not a BAC device. We're not in that space, the punitive space. This is a safety device, safety technology. He believes it's the first of its kind in the country. So whether you're driving or not, the bracelet is constantly reading if you have alcohol in your system. Then at all times, you can see the results on this app, and so could someone like a parent. When they see the app, they'll see the location of where their child is, and they'll see whether or not that child has any alcohol in their system. Gandini sees the bracelet as a safety net for parents who hope to prevent underage drinking and poor decisions. Outside of that, he sees an opportunity for employers and even people in recovery. We want people to make healthy and safe decisions, and this is another tool. Fran Lanzer with Mothers Against Drunk Driving is hopeful too. His organization is now partnering with SoberSafe, eventually offering a discount on the bracelet. New technologies that are coming online are giving people, you know, at their fingertips, tools that they can use to help keep themselves safe, to help keep their families safe. And those tools are, are really uh, just so important in helping people do the right thing. In Denver, Connor McHugh covering Colorado First.